A gold medal in the Commonwealth Games in Delhi brought Ian Weaver out of the shadows and into the limelight. The 22-year-old from Dorset fights in Bulgaria later this month to secure his Olympic place. He is determined to take the spot, convinced he can bring home a medal. I enjoy the pressure, you know, when I went to the Commonwealth Games, we were in front of a hostile crowd and, you know, that just brings the lads on. Even Every lad on the squad, they, they enjoy the pressure and the crowds normally, but normally we've got crowds against us, so when we box in London, you know, if I box in London, the crowds will be with us, you know, so it'd be nice to see what that's like. Boxing has always been in Ian's life. I Weaver. This is his first competitive bout when he was just 11 years old. The winner by a unanimous decision, Weaver. His dad, Jay, used to fight. His granddad, Brian, boxed in the army. And mum, Jean, is a boxing judge. It's a big family affair. We, it's not just, uh, not just our family. It's, uh, when Ian was a five-year-old, we, we took him to a, a good friend of mine called Charlie Cooper's. That's where he started off uh, with his brother, Gary. And uh, he's never looked back. He's always been very, very good. It's the good jab, really, the sort of scorn that you can talk around the ringside that you can actually see quite clearly are the jabs. And Ian's very good at that, picking the shots. Does he take after his dad and his granddad? Um, maybe his dad, yeah. I don't know about his granddad. <laughs> the fight is three rounds lasting three minutes each, which doesn't sound a lot, but when you see the speed and the effort involved, you can see how physically demanding it is. Ready or not, here I come, you can't hide, gonna find you. But his coach at the Golden Ring ABC in Southampton knows Ian has the skills and fitness, and more so since moving from bantamweight up to lightweight. Sky's the limit, really. Um, he's medalled in every tournament he's gone to. I think he's capable of medalling in the Olympics. With the home support, I believe he could come back with a gold medal in the Olympics. Ferndown near Bournemouth isn't renowned for its boxing history, but Ian Weaver intends to change that. So I know the punches are hard, but if you did hit me, what would happen? You wouldn't wake up for a while. <laughs> Sally Simmons in Southampton for Meridian Tonight.